Hello and welcome to this review of the Fumi Palm audio adapter. This is how it came. This is it. So let's open it up. This is it. So it just came in that packaging. So it's really simple. We have a USB-C input here. Our mic jack goes in here. So on the Fumi Palm, all it does is it goes in like so. So one of the issues with the Fimi Palm when using the internal mic here is you get a lot of handling noise. So if I press this, if I use the joystick, you'll be able to hear the handling noise. And one of the other problems you get with the Fimi Palm is if it's windy, you get terrible wind noise because you've only got this small microphone and the wind cuts across it. There's no way to prevent the wind cutting across it. So now I'm gonna do an audio test comparing the internal microphone of the Fimi Palm against an external mic using the Fimi Palm adapter. So I'm gonna put it next to this USB fan and we're gonna see how it handles wind noise. So this is recording audio with the Fimi Palm against a fan, a USB fan. I'm less than arm's distance away from the Fimi Palm and I'm just using the internal mic. I'm now going to keep talking and I'm going to turn the Fimi so that the internal microphone is facing the fan and away again and turn it around full circle. I'm now going to do some noise. I'm now going to... Next I'm just going to move the gimbal head. So now I'm recording with the Fimi Palm. I've got the Rode Wireless Go system plugged into the Fimi Palm audio adapter. And I've been using this to record most of the video and so it makes sense to transfer it here. Of course, any microphone will do, any external microphone will drastically improve the audio quality. So first of all, I'm going to hold it next to the fan and we're gonna see what effect that has. I'm gonna turn it against the fan down 360 degrees as before and then I'm going to just do some movements of the camera see if we pick up any audio noise so you could say it's an unfair test because I'm obviously not in the wind so I've taken the Rode Wireless Go's transmitter off off my shirt and I put it down really close to the fan I have put the wind muff on because the dead cat or wind muff does come with it and so what I'm doing now is I'm putting this really close to the source of the wind just to see how things compare. And again, I'll do the um, panning test again just so you can compare, just to see if we get any handling noise. So I'm recording with the Rode Wireless Go plugged into the Fimi Palm via the audio adapter. So the Rode Wireless Go plugged into the Fimi Palm via the audio adapter with the wind muff or dead cut put on. Has it made any difference? Is the audio quality any better? Just going to move the joystick, do some joystick clicks.